Hi guys, good morning. I'm not even gonna come on here and pretend like I am so energetic because I am tired, like tired. The girls and I are out at Tim Hortons. Where I got this, Brie got her chicken sandwich, which she's eaten. We picked up this, what's this one? Oh, like mm. banana lemonade. Banana, banana lemonade, lemonade smoothie. Mm -hmm. Your girl got herself a peppermint tea. After this, we're gonna run to the grocery store. Mm -hmm. Guys, so we're, we're in our local grocery store picking up some stuff. The girls want to pick up romaine hearts. We're going to pick up a bunch of those because they want to make Caesar salads with that. Hi guys, Sarah here. Welcome back to the Zebra Tribe fam. So today we've got a nice little grocery haul for you guys. However, I did not do my grocery shopping at Costco like I typically do. I decided to go to the local grocery store this time around. But guys, stay tuned for the rest of the haul. Watch from the beginning to end to see exactly what I got. I got so many good deals and I'm gonna tell you about some stuff, stuff that I bought last week at like another grocery store that's a higher end grocery store and I pay like triple the price. So stay tuned for the rest of the haul to see all the goodies that we bought. This is a pretty large haul. I kind of say it's a bit of a massive haul considering I still don't have everything else that I need. I still will have to do some shopping at Costco and I have a list that hubby will have to pick up on the way home. So I'm gonna do a separate haul for that because it's already a big haul. If you guys don't know, we are a family of six. So we are already, we're classified as a big family. And so we need a lot of food to feed all the mouths in our house. So stay tuned for the haul. I'm gonna stop talking, let's jump right in it. So guys, because I was already on the street for a little bit and it took us a while to get home, I wanna start with all the perishables that we got. Beginning over, we're gonna start from right to left. So starting with here, I picked up this pasta. This is a spaghetti pasta because we wanna have um, spaghetti and meatballs, which I will continue to show you in this haul. This is, a, this is a different brand. I've never bought this before, so we decided to try it. We bought a lot of rotinis because I do enjoy uh, making different meals with those. I bought this whole grain rotini for myself because I am watching my um, my figure. <laughs> no, I'm trying to focus more on whole grain for myself. We have this pre-mix, original fluffy pancake mix. We usually make our own pancakes and stuff from scratch because I am raising a bunch of little women, so it's good to teach them to do that stuff. But it's nice to have something that we can go to every now and again. Cheerios. Everyone loves Cheerios and we <laughs> like to mix it up. You guys have seen a lot of the other stuff that we've been buying, so it's good to have a change. Stevia. Uh, we got Stevia because we wanted to get something, an alternative to just sugar. I've heard a lot of great things about this, so I am really excited to try it. It's then I got these two packages of trail mix. Guys, I bought these at a local grocery store last week, two for five dollars. This week I bought them two for, I believe, two 89 which is insane so it's worth it's worth um checking things out right isn't that yeah. crazy that's a crazy price difference then we bought some other granola bars we bought two packages of those they got a marshmallow one then the kids wanted to try the marshmallow one then they wanted was <laughs> pop tarts so i try to stick with natural stuff a lot of fruits and stuff but every now and again we indulge in those things then we've got a whole bunch of yogurts one two i think we got six right three four five six 
mini yogurts and I got these specifically for the baby last week but everyone really liked them they're the mini go yogurts and they're really tasty actually they're not bad so then we got some Macintosh apples hubby, hubby is not gonna like those those are not our favorites but um we just had to pick some up right now we'll have to get the ones we want at Costco then we picked up some romaine lettuce. We picked up two packages of those because we still have a mixture. We have a Caesar salad kit that we want to use this for. So we're going to go ahead and use that. I picked up a cabbage. I want to make a cabbage soup like I have recently and I really liked it. I used half of it to make with corned beef and so I will be doing that. Red peppers, really love those for cooking. Or it's Well, it's an assorted pack actually. But it's really nice to have these as an alternative for cooking. Guys, I picked up plantain. Huh? Yes, I love plantain. Yeah. We love plantain. So we picked up two of those. We picked up two of these blue menu seasoning packs. One is a fajita one and one's for taco. It's taco seasoning. I've never used them before, but they are blue menu and they're lower. They they are not as loaded in sodium as the other ones. Yeah, we got some pears. While shopping, the man informed us, because we were picking up the other pairs, and the man informed us that these ones were on sale. Almost like a dollar off in comparison, so we swapped those out and got these ones. I don't even know what they're called, but we got six of those. A bag of carrots, because we really like carrots. And juice! Iced tea. We have two boxes of lemonade or lemon, lemon iced tea. tea. So that box of lemon iced tea, the boxes that they bought were actually... They're the same price as Minute Maid, and the kids do prefer this one because it actually tastes better. It's kind of sad to say. Yeah, the kids choose this one. It's the same price as Minute Maid, but they are just, these ones honestly taste better, and so it's good to look into stuff like that as well. Eagles, one sesame. Two everything. Two everything. And mom got this bread. Yep, then I got my bread, and this is what? Whole this one is called flax and quinoa. Not my typical bread because you guys know mine is bought in um, bulk, but this will do. And it's actually lower in sodium than the bread that I typically buy, which is insane. So I'm excited to try that. Got the kids some Wonder Bread. This is going to be good for grilled cheese or French toast. And then we got some hot dogs, hot dog buns to go with the hot dogs. So back down here, we got donuts. The girls picked this up last minute. And you know what? The girls tired. I don't have time to negotiate about um, junk food. So they bought this and it was, I'm sure they'll enjoy that. Here I have some old fashioned sugar. So even though I bought the stevia, we had to pick this up because the girls and everyone, you know, we do a lot of baking. So some recipes do call for brown sugar and it's good to have that on hand. We got our 2% milk. The kids drink this stuff. We have the 3.25% here, the homogenized milk. This is for the baby. She's still not drinking it in the way she does. I feel like I'm wasting milk, but I do mix it in stuff like oatmeal and various things for her. Then to my little meat section. I have a lot of meat in the fridge already, so I didn't need to necessarily pick up a lot of meats, but I did pick up a couple of things. Hot dogs being one of them, easy hot dog dinner. I am learning to not have to cook every single day. So it's nice to have things that we can just have on the go. Corned beef, uh, we do pick this up here and there. This stuff is $5 a tin, even though it's, you know, it's, it's not cheap. Then I picked up meatballs. Ideally, it would be nice to make some homemade meatballs, but these are one of the best. Like, they're so tasty and they have low sodium. So that is a good, good buy. Picked up some Jane's pub style burgers. They we used to buy this for the kids a long time ago. We used to buy them for like thirteen dollars, fourteen dollars. This was six dollars, uh, six something. I don't recall. Maybe six ninety seven for this box. And I'm like, what? How is the price significantly different? I hope it's not because it's bad or anything. But yeah, these are pretty good. You can cut them up and make them into chicken strips and put them in a wrap as well to make a chicken sandwich. You can make them just to go on a burger like that. Or you can even serve them as a side with fries. So yeah, you can, there are multiple uses for burger, chicken patty burgers. We've got black beans, typical. I got one, two, three, three cans. And those are my go-to to have, you know, just on certain nights when I'm making everyone else something and I don't want to eat a lot of that. So like sodium filled food. And then I got this for the meatballs and the spaghetti. We got this French's 
mustard. I usually get this at Costco because you can get a large double double container, like you're buying it in bulk. But this will do. It's like two something for it, so not super expensive. But I do prefer to buy it in bulk because I can have some go downstairs in the our in our cellar slash pantry, and we you know we'll have some for next time. I do like having stuff in my pa pantry that I can run for at various times when we're running low on food upstairs. Guys, we also got this watermelon. It's a mini one. I am the worst at shopping for watermelon, guys. I don't know how to shop for them worth a darn, but let's hope this is a good one. We also picked up this treat. This is um, milk chocolate covered almonds. I thought it was a good treat because today we're all kind of just going to chill a little bit. We came in super late last night so late so we're all a bit tired and under the weather right now and we are going to um just have a chill day so i thought it'd be nice to have some of those little mini snacks so guys so that is it for this haul hope you guys enjoyed it there are a lot of good goodies especially for the kids I've, and um yeah i think they're gonna enjoy all the stuff here we still have to pick up stuff from costco we still have to pick up stuff from hold on i want to take a quick screenshot i want to i still have to pick up a cup we want to get jamaican patties and we still have to pick that up at a different store because this store didn't have it and nor does costco sell that either so hi guys thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe to join the tribe Subscribe, subscribe. <laughs>